And so now from the Red Bull Arena in Leipzig, just across the Elster Basin from the plush Kotteweg training facility. Derek Ray here in the commentary position, and I'm joined as always by Lee Dixon. And we're in position and ready to bring you live action from the German top flight, the Bundesliga. It's RB Leipzig up against Hertha Berlin. Yeah, really looking forward to this one, Derek. Excite me, come on, let's see some entertainment. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man. Lee, what are you anticipating seeing from him? Well, I love watching him. He's got quick feet, quick mind. He wants you to come close to you so he can get past you. So his defenders normally stand off him, and then he's got more time to pick the pass he wants, and he normally finds the best one. And let's have a look at the starting 11 for Leipzig. Peter Gulacci is the goalkeeper of choice. Marcel Halstenberg starts with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. And it's two strikers up front who'll look to provide the goal scoring threat. A look at the Hertha starting lineup. Alexander Schwolo stands between the posts. Vladimir Darida plays with Luka Tussar in central midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Every reason to expect this will be an attractive match. And it's Leipzig who kick it off. Forsberg. Now with Upamecano. Konrad Leiber. Paulsen. Marcel Zabitza. Excellent vision. A fine reading of the situation. Luca Bacchio. A super tackle and they've won possession. Nkunku. Forsberg. Powerson. It should be! Perfectly fair tackle and it will be a corner. comes did his job defensively insufficient guile on the crossing front you've got to say Darida Mateus Cunha and Pekarek in possession conviction in the challenge it's opening up for them there wasn't much of that offside decision could have been in business Marcel Zabitza Losing possession a bit easily. An incisive pass. A oh, big opportunity. Now the keeper grabs it. Mateus Cunha. It's with Tusar. Real danger. Terrific block there.
Danny Olmo. Excellent ball over the top. And the penalty is converted. I don't think anyone really questioned him. Well, here it is again, and I can tell you what, I'm not sure I've ever seen a penalty converted like this before. What is the keeper doing? He has to do better. He's basically right at him. So poor. One nil then. Mateus Cunha. Oh, he's given us away. Forsberg. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Tactically quite clear what they're doing, trying to get right on top of their opponents. Visualisation and execution. Able to deal with the threat. Well, they've won themselves a corner and a chance perhaps to add an additional goal for security. Played into the centre of the box. Taking care of business defensively here. Well, no stopping him. A deep delivery. Well, he's given a corner, their referee. And this again, the goal that was scored from the spot. He's driven in the corner. The end product just wasn't there. And he cuts inside. Good tackle. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Not a lot to like about Marcel Zabica and his first half showing. Lee, how would you sum it up? Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Maximilian Mittelstedt. It's with Vladimir Darida. A really sumptuous ball. Can he open them up here? A tremendous block. And cleared away. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. And there's the feed into the box. Well, not a cross that will live long in the memory. Goal kick.
Emil Forsberg. Getting in there to take it away. Maximilian Mittelstädt. Forsberg. Oh, in with a chance! Oh, that was a terrific stop in a one-versus-one one situation. Well, high fives all round for the goalkeeper. Absolutely fantastic. So the corner played into the box. A very effective clearance. Well, the host dominating possession, it really has been impressive. They've created a lot from midfield. Their forwards are having a field day. Coach will be really happy with the creativity, but he'd be even happier if he can extend their lead now. Very happy indeed. Darida. Oh, lovely ball. Mateus Cunha. Real chance. Oh, it's a penalty in the opinion of the referee and maybe they'll be able to level this up a clear penalty and a yellow card to boot a penalty in all sorts of ways the keeper can save it but to hit it over the bar possession given away Mateus Cunha and it's with Askasibar Darida losing possession a bit easily I must say this looks promising he made it look simple really oh a perfectly timed pass can he finish this and thwarting his opponent in the nick of time Santiago Ascasibar, an effective ball. And into an attacking position, it's not too late for them. To the box it goes. Now they've lost it. Well, they worked so hard here to be in front, and that's been recognised by the supporters. They just need to hold on a bit longer to see this out. Peter Pekarik. Luca Bacchio work to regain possession crisp tackling trailing as they are they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game and we are going to have two additional minutes now can they counter clinically And that will be all for this game as the referee blows the whistle and Leipzig have picked up maximum points lead. Well, Derek, either side could have won that. That's how tight it was. That will feel like six points, not three. Well, he stamped his mark on the game, Marcel Zabitza. Lee, what did you make of his contribution? Well, he's always a danger, isn't he? No more so when he grabbed that goal. 
He never disappoints me when I watch him. He's just too good, simple.